This is the Best Stocks to Buy podcast. Looking for quality stock tips? Well, we bring you timely investment ideas based on the latest stock and market outlooks. Our ideas are driven by a proprietary software that reviews, analyzes, and ranks for 6,000 stocks every week. So you may hear the name of a company you haven't heard of before. And you know what? That is often the best kind of opportunity, an opportunity to get in early before the investing masses. The Best Stocks to Buy podcast is made possible by Connor Management Group, a registered investment management firm serving individuals, business owners, and family offices. Hi, everyone. Before we get on with our podcast this week, I wanted to take a moment to tell you about a recent development. We have recently completed development of a mobile app. We call it our Mobile Investing Companion app. Its name is called the Best Stocks to Buy Plus. Uh, We put quite a bit of thought into this app. I wanted it to be something that would truly bring you value. This is not a mobile app that just presents you pictures of stock charts with a long list of numbers. This app will in one place present to you timely information to make you a better investor. The app uploads our latest podcast episode for easy listening, has investing lessons, market news, expert interviews, videos, additional stock ideas, along with the ability for you to easily text me any questions you may have. The app is free with plenty of features and also has a premium option that unlocks even more value. Think about this. You can have access to free, valuable information in your hip pocket. Yet, you have a burning question? With a monthly premium subscription, you can reach out to me directly and receive attractive stock tips driven by an algorithm based on the conditions of now. This is a -a one-of-a-kind investing app that we developed ourselves, not available anywhere else. We're excited because we've received feedback that it's a great app. It would mean a lot to me if you checked it out for yourself. Download it today. Share it with others. Just go to our website for the download link on your mobile device at www.connermg.com. That's C-O-N-N-E-R-M-G.com. We're only offering the Android version for now. We expect to release the iOS version soon. Hi, everyone. This is Mathis Connor with Connor Management Group, and this is the Best Stocks to Buy podcast. Today is Monday, June 11th, 2018. And this week, we're going to look at the best dividend stock to buy right now. Uh, On to our opening slide. It's called the Setup and the Approach. Now, the key objective of this podcast is to present to you a high probability upside potential stock. Now, the key tool we use is a financial model or proprietary tool we develop that uses multiple valuation approaches across over 6,000 stocks that we review every week. So the view you're getting is not driven by some sensational headline in some popular publication focused on increasing readership, but based simply on the investment opportunity. Uh, an easy way of thinking about approaches is to think about the method of triangulation that law enforcement uses to locate a cell phone. In our case, we use a form of triangulation to locate a future stock price using different valuation methods. Uh, Now, I truly view creating such a financial model as daunting, but I believe I was well prepared for the challenge. I have both computer programming experience as an engineer and over $15 billion of transaction experience as a finance and development guy to judge the research I reviewed. So my approach didn't come overnight. I painstakingly reviewed over 40 years of white papers, taking away the best that each had to offer then added some of my own tested intuition to implement new data sets that weren't even available as little as 10 years ago. Uh, furthermore, my financial model uses both historical and projected values and takes into account managers' historical accuracy of meeting the projections they share with the public. A uh, point worth remembering, these views are based on today, uh, an unforeseen economic report, original conflict, or revised policy can change these expectations tomorrow. Uh, benefit of using a professional money manager like kind of management group is having someone experienced in making educated assessments about the uncontrollable as well as having someone to readily share uh, their opinion or whether a particular event is the reason for concern. And now, so what did our model find for you this week? Uh, we found 
a uh, investment opportunity that is in the oil and gas distribution assets industry. Uh, here's the industry overview slide. Okay, the oil and gas distribution asset industry is comprised of tax advantage, oil and gas transporting, processing, and distribution companies. Uh, these companies are often what are called master limited partnerships or MLPs for short. Now, MLPs typically do not take title to the hydrocarbons. So these are just the assets that for processing and moving them around. Uh, these MLPs, they do usually do not pay state or federal income taxes. Uh, now, just to level set, here are the 10 largest competitors by market cap, in case some of the names might be familiar to you. Uh, we start off with Enterprise Products Partners, Enbridge, Williams Partners, Kinder Morgan, TransCanada, MPLX, Sempra Energy, Energy Transfer Partners, Williams Companies, Energy Transfer Equity. Uh, now here are some growth drivers uh, for this industry. Uh, oil and gas production now is trending higher, and expansion projects are expected to continue are expected to continue due to low interest rates and decreasing regulation. Uh, some of the industry challenges: uh, there's been downward share price pressures related to revised regulatory cost recovery rules that have been placed since 2005 and management of market demands as oil prices increases versus gas. So the name of the stock that we found for you this week is called Endeavor Logistics LP. The ticker symbol is ANDX and we see their up their six month upside potential at greater than 40%, and the dividend yield is at a whopping 9.1%. Now, just so you know, um, MLPs typically pay a high dividend yield, and also owners of MLPs typically pay taxes on that dividend yield. So, I mean, to be conservative, you could you know, reduce that dividend yield by a third in your mind, but it's still a very healthy dividend yield. And uh, we think Endeavor Logistics' future looks bright. Uh, on to the quick fact slide. Endeavor Logistics, formerly Tesoro Logistics LP, is a full-service logistics company operating primarily in the western and mid-continent United States. It owns and operates a network of crude oil, refined products, and natural gas pipelines, terminals with storage capacity for crude oil and refined products, rail facilities, marine terminals, a trucking fleet, and natural gas processing and fractionation complexes. So as you can see, this is a massive limited partnership that just owns a lot of assets for moving around and storing, transporting hydrocarbons. Uh, the website is www.endeavorlogistics.com. That's A-N-D-E-A-V-O-R logistics.com. Uh, the company's headquartered in San Antonio, Texas. They were founded in 2010, and they have 518 employees. On to the metrics slide. The annual revenue for Endeavor uh, Logistics over the last 12 months was $3.3 billion. Their net income over the last 12 months was $340 million, and their cash from operations was $732 million. So this is a sizable company sizable company, but they're not, they're not huge, huge. Uh, the operating margins for 2017 were a healthy 29.2%, but for 2018, they were a staggering 56.5%. Uh, that is an extremely healthy increase in, in operating margins, and we also think that maybe uh, this is something that the whole market hasn't caught on to yet. Uh, on to the valuation metrics. The trailing P.E. ratio right now stands at 21, and the forward P.E. ratio is 14. And that implies that earnings are expected to increase strongly. You know, you, you, you really would like to see a decrease from trailing to forward P.E. ratios for our investment opportunities. Uh, the PEG ratio is at 1.0, also an attractive value for a value investment. The price to sales ratio is at 2.9. 
The price to book ratio is at 3.2 and the enterprise value to EBITDA ratio stands at 13.4. And once again, as already mentioned, the dividend yield is at 9.1%. Uh, on to the price chart for Endeavor Logistics. Uh, the company stock has been a, a bit volatile over the past 12 months. Uh, basically, the stock is down now to around forty uh three uh forty three dollars and uh let's see the stock and industry pullback from the spring of twenty seventeen was due to warmer than normal weather. So subsequent volatility and there was subsequent volatility related to multiple acqui- asset acquisitions the company made. Uh strong earnings uh are expected over the next two years makes this price seem quite low. On to the next slide, we call it looking back and looking forward. Now, looking back, the share earnings have been up almost 16% on a 43% increase in earnings. Operating margins, as I already mentioned, are up strongly to 56% in 2018 versus 29% in 2017. And the company has grown from multiple acquisitions and has benefited from higher oil and gas prices. Uh, demand, uh, yeah, yeah, from higher oil and gas prices. Uh, looking forward, the company's uh, largest shareholder is planning to combine with Marathon Petroleum, which will likely result in additional assets being transferred into Endeavor Logistics. Our earnings and cash flow uh, are expected to strongly increase over the next two years, and distribution increases, you know, slash dividends are expected to continue in the near future to maintain the firm's above average yield. Our next slide is called the why now, the bull rationale. Uh, We see the stock going up for a couple of reasons, Uh, mainly uh, increasing sales uh, per share over the next two years. And right now, the valuation metric is low. And it's expected to be even lower, as discussed earlier, in the near future. It's all drivers for an increase in stock price. Uh, on to the next slide is the summary slide. Uh, financial statement quality of Endeavor Logistics we consider to be quite good. The operating margin trend improving, as we already spoke to. The price pattern trend uh, we consider it negative because of just general industry-related pullbacks. Uh, industry outlook, we are upbeat and positive on it. Overall market outlook, we're positive. Uh, the recent closing price for Endeavor Logistics was $43.73. Our six-month price target is at $60, and we see this company is having a six-month upside potential of greater than 40%. So it's for all these reasons that we believe that Endeavor Logistics is the best dividend stock to buy right now. We hope you found this presentation helpful. I'll talk to you again soon. Take care. Hello, everyone. This broadcast was made by Connor Management Group. We are a registered investment advisor and money manager for individuals, businesses, and family offices. We are not your typical financial advisor in that we invest our clients' funds directly into individual stock positions. We do not put our clients into other stock mutual funds. At Connor Management Group, We help you grow and protect your assets. We craft high growth investment portfolios for your children and other minors. We manage the rolled over assets from 401k accounts. We manage IRA and trust accounts. So how do we go about serving our clients? One big differentiator is that we develop some pretty comprehensive computer software that reviews, analyzes, and ranks over 6,000 stocks on a weekly basis. And from that, we create concentrated investment portfolios of well-researched and closely watched stocks. Furthermore, we operate under a managed account arrangement. And that means you open and fund a brokerage account in your name, and we simply manage your investments electronically. That gives you, our client, the greatest control and transparency possible. You can learn more about our service at www.connermg.com. Additionally, we set up a group on the LinkedIn platform. The name of our group is simply called Stock Investing Tips, Better Returns, Bigger Pockets. Now, this is a private group, which means you have to click the Ask to Join link. 
We do this because we want to be able to control the quality of the member experience. So if you like what you heard and you would like to receive more timely investment information and be able to post questions, just send me a message to ask to join our LinkedIn group. You can readily find my profile on LinkedIn. That's Mathis Connor. That's M-A-T-H-I-S-C-O-N-N-E-R. And if you have any problems connecting, just send me an email at mathis at connormg.com. Well, that's all for now. And I'll talk to you in our next broadcast or hopefully with you in our LinkedIn group. All right, everyone. Have a great week.